Hi, it's Clark. And Emily. From Sailing Vessel Temptress. And today we're answering another one of your questions. Today's is from uh, TK Shakur, who asks, where are we from? Well, I'm from uh, northern New York State, way away from the city. I uh, grew up in an area that has more cows than people by far. Uh, my immediate family, my dad was a barber, my mom was a school nurse, but grandparents, uncles, cousins, everybody else were dairy farmers. So I worked on a dairy farm an awful lot as a kid. I left there because, well, there was no tech there whatsoever, and I do technology. Uh, traveled around a bit, went to Boston, uh, went to Austin, Texas. Then I uh, went out to Seattle, and I really liked Seattle, so I settled down and bought Temptress, moved aboard the boat, and kept doing projects in Seattle until I uh, retired at 36. And then Temptress and I took off and went sailing. And I am also from a small town. I grew up in Wisconsin and uh, spent all my childhood there, went to college there, then moved to the Twin Cities for a short time to take a job there and then uh, moved to Florida uh, in 2010, and I've been there since. Uh, again, we took off on the boat <laughs> in about 2016, so we've been living most of the time on the boat. So now I would say we both say we're from the boat. Yeah, we're from the <laughs> boat. We live on Temptress way more than we live in uh, other, but we do, we have a house, a very small, very modest house in Florida, and we'll be keeping it because I have a, I have an elderly grandmother. She's 95. She's in like really great shape. She still runs her own household, but she doesn't drive anymore. So during the winter, she lives in an apartment I built for her in that house. So she's got, well, what used to be my garage and such, and she has her own apartment. So as long as she wants it, we'll be keeping that house. Mm -hmm. So we have a little home base. To expand your question a little bit more, mm -hmm. um, not just where we're from, but how we grew up might be of interest to people. I think yep. we have a lot in common. We both came from towns with more cows than people. <laughs> we both came from two-parent households. Uh -huh. um, we both uh, grew up, I think, with an appreciation for what we had and mm -hmm. using what we had and kind of recycling things, making things ourselves. My mother did a lot of gardening and canning and sewing yep. and those sorts of things. I think both of our parents are big on personal responsibility mm -hmm. and not, uh, you know, feeling that big brother of the government should take care of us. Mm -hmm. So we uh, do things for ourselves still. Yeah, ah, I, think, <laughs> I think we both learned to be pretty independent, pretty self-sufficient, um, to plan ahead, to do the, the ant thing rather than the grasshopper thing. I think also I, we both grew up in places that were like crazy cold. I grew yeah. up in a place where the army actually moved their cold weather survival training base from Alaska to my county because we had colder weather. Mm -hmm. And that changes your attitude. You. Like if you live in the South, I imagine you've, you've lived generations of, ah, eh, we'll get the firewood in eventually because we can always go do it. Mm -hmm. Where we're from, if you don't start the winter season with all of your food, you know, generations back and all your energy in your house, you're going to freeze and starve. There's mm -hmm. just no way to get anything in December because the snow is taller than your head. Yeah, and if you don't start your tomato plants as soon as, you know, indoors <laughs> before the frost and then guess the frost right, you don't have your harvest before it's too cold to grow things. And yeah. All those sorts of things. So we both were from New York and Wisconsin, but we're also from this planning ahead um, sort of attitude. Just we kind of share the same values, mm -hmm. uh, say, share the same, uh, you know, parental lessons and things that we learned and learn not to waste and learn to Yeah, both to of our parents, both yeah. of our mothers made clothes for us. Mm -hmm. Uh, all that kind of yeah. uh, we, homespunny kind of stuff. But we also were both bright enough to go to warm places. <laughs> yeah. And we both grew up outdoors. Uh, neither of us came from a sailing family. No. Um, I grew up camping. I went to summer camp every year for 10 years, and we used to ca go camping as a family. So I learned about canoeing and, you know, pooping outside and all that <laughs> stuff. <laughs> I went to summer camp, too, even longer. I was a counselor there right up into college, actually. Yeah. Yeah, so we're from different places. We're both from the U.S., uh, and we, I guess we come from similar backgrounds, even mm -hmm. though our ages are so different and we have different generations, but I think we were both raised with kind of yeah. the same mentality. So anyway, that's where we're from. So <laughs> hopefully that answers your question. If you have more questions, feel free to ask them in the comment section, and uh, we'll talk to you again soon. Bye. Bye.